Maybe if I put my hood up, I'll look more intimidating. I think it's working. I look bigger. <laughs> Big marshmallow. Welcome to a Farming Life YouTube channel where we do life, we do family, and of course, we do farming. From our family to yours, welcome. There's all our ladies waiting for breakfast. Hey, the boys are feeding, so I will update you what's going on here. We are moving the cows, and we have had them on corn stalk since they came out of the pasture. Once it gets kind of cold, we take them off the grass. That way, when they have their babies in about a month we might we might see a few at the end of february but normally they start popping and dropping at a march beginning of march and anyway if we go ahead and take them off um before they eat the grass down they'll be plenty um when they have their babies and then we can put them straight on out on the pasture and so that's what we've done every year or at least every year since i've been married and been a part of this um then when we take them off the pasture, we usually put them on corn stalk and leave them. Every year is different um, because you want the ground to be frozen. But um, it's like, how do I explain this? <laughs> so basically when the ground thaws, they just kind of tramp it down and then they make the entire field into just a mud puddle um, or a mud pit. And um, obviously we don't want that in our uh, great, wonderful, valuable cornfield. So we move them off and then they go to the feedlot. And if it freezes again, we'll move them back out. And then when it thaws again, we'll move them back to the feedlot. So anyway, it has been frozen for a really long time now. Yeah, so, so we got a late start and they're all ready. Uh, they're waiting for their breakfast. So all we really have to do is drive the, drive the feed truck up to that gate and they'll just follow and it'll be awesome and that's the best way to do it. So, but anyway, I feel so fancy in my coat. I got this from, I think it was like Zulily a few years ago. It had to have been Zulily because it was non-returnable and it was in um, European sizing, which is different than American sizing. And so it came a little big and as you can tell, it's light colored and I felt like a huge marshmallow, but it was non-returnable and I thought, oh, you know, I don't want to donate it. I'll keep on, I'll hold on to it because I might use it like when I'm pregnant or something because I'll need a bigger coat and then obviously you can't help looking like a marshmallow because you just look like one anyway. So anyway, this is a feathered down coat and it's really awesome actually because it's so, like I can move. I've never been able to move this much in any of my work coats. It's awesome, especially because like the Carhartts and the Bernies, you know, they especially once you get really big, I feel like they're a little restricting. And so this is not, this is very like, woo, it's awesome. So anyway, we're gonna go move some cows. See ya. There they are. At first they were like, what is this? Um, so now they'll just fall. All right, so all the way back there, they're coming and then you just make another pile. Ah, I can't see. Um, so I just made another pile and they just basically follow me to each pile. And then they'll get the idea once we get a little closer to the feedlot. They'll go right in usually, hopefully. Looks like they're trying to go to shop now. So, huh. that'll be fun for Rhett. Hello, ladies. So I'm just standing here on the road, preventing them from hopefully going down the road. And hopefully when Rhett comes, oh yeah, there she sees it. She sees the feedlot, she knows what that is. There will be food waiting for them in the feedlot, so um, they know the drill. We do this every year. They're pretty smart. Ah, cow. I'm not jumping in front of you. Please do not come. Okay, I'm going to focus here. Maybe if I put my hood up, I'll look more intimidating. I think it's working. I look bigger. <laughs> Big marshmallow. I look a little out of place, but I feel so fancy. Whew. So this coat has been the best thing ever. It's so warm. I'm never going back. <laughs> never. Uh, 